Hello everyone, my name is Cap and welcome back to the channel. We're on day 39 of our Darkness Fall series here in Seven Days to Die. We got everything looted last night, uh, as much as we could. I'm I didn't get through the pallets and stuff like that, but as far as like all the individual boxes and everything that was on top of these things, you can technically reach those from the ceiling height. And so I went around and did those. I know there was like an ammo thing on top of there. I think there was an ammo thing on top of there. So I got everything that was in here that I could find last night, and I'm gonna peek through one more time just to make sure I didn't miss anything on the tops like that oh okay so I didn't actually miss anything did I miss any coffee uh sure I'll take them I already have some there so the things that I could reach I guess I should say I got I wish I could take these lanterns with me those are so so freaking nice yeah so I think I got everything else that was in this building and uh yeah we're ready to head back outside and I want to see if there's a way hang on I should probably switch to something with bullets I want to see if there's a way to either take this with me, break into it, something. I don't, I don't, I've never seen this before. This is clearly not something that's in vanilla, obviously. Anything in the mailbox? So I don't know if maybe I could just hit this and... Okay, alright, so that's going to take a little bit of beating. Uh, well, that was, that's exactly what I was trying to do. Hang on, uh, oh, there we go. Oh. That, okay, fine, fine, just fine. We'll do it your way, the hard way. We're gonna get, whoops, one too many scrolls. Trying to hit him. Accidentally switched over to gun, tried to pistol whip him. So you guys can take more than one power hit to the face. It's like a power hit and a small little jab and you're good. Oh, oh okay. I spoke a little bit too soon. No big deal at all. All right, so we need to see if we can get inside this thing before we start heading out. Because I don't know what's in here. I mean, it'd be kind of cool if there's like a, you know, a crap ton of ammo and things like that in there. If I get up here too, obviously this thing's got quite a bit of an uh, armor on it. So anything besides birds come flying up at me over here, I should be okay. Now the big thing is if something big comes running at me and hits this, is it going to explode and kill me? I don't know. We got a ways to go to get in here, so let's see which one works better. Let's see. This does 50 at a time. Let's see what this does. Okay, so that does better. It's still going to take a while to get through, but we got time, so we might as well just sit here and see, because I want to know what's in here. I really want to drive it back home, but I doubt the game's going to let me. So let's get in here real quick. All right, there we go. Military truck. Let's see if it's got anything good inside of it. A pickaxe and an engine. A steel pack pickaxe. It's better than the one I have, but it's still just a pickaxe. All of that for a freaking pickaxe? Oh, that that just kind of hurts my feels. I, I really feel like there should have been more in there. Like, I don't know, a gun, some ammo, something for this big beast of a vehicle. That's just, uh, it just kind of hurts, you know? Well... I guess it is what it is. We got... Let me see. If I just go straight this direction, I can kind of backtrack. Oh, hell. Of course there's a freaking bird here. Why wouldn't there be? He waited until I got on the bike before he spawned it. Come here, you bastard. Why can't I not shoot you? There we go. Oh, Lord. That's a fantastic way to start out the day. Okay, so we just need to follow this road straight out of town and get back over this tiny little hill, a.k.a. small mountain. And get back over the trader and see if maybe he has anything good for us for all our troubles. We did get two clearings done last time, so maybe he'll have something good for us. And then we can see what kind of exciting adventure he's going to send us on next. If I can angle it to cut off a little bit, because I don't want to do just 90 degree angles, considering I have to go all the way. But hey, there's a bear. Yeah, we're going to take that 90 degree angle right now. We're just going to see if we can't bob and weave and see if we figure out a way to get back over to some sort of road system. So, let's go for a ride, shall we? Oh, hold up, hold up. We got an airdrop over here. I don't know when this one came in. I Obviously, I missed it. We got we got to go a little bit off-road and try and get this one here because we can get some good stuff in the airdrops. So, um, I don't know when this one... I could have swore we got one that was over in this general area not that long ago, but, you know, who knows what day that actually was. It'd be nice if we got something really good. Make up for the crap that we got in that truck. Something fun. Uh, Trigger plates. Another chainsaw. I told you the game wants me to have one. Slightly better hammer, a machete that's the exact same as we have, duct tape. All right, well, 
it's not terrible. It's just stuff. It's it's not the kind of stuff that you ride home to mom about and be proud that you got it. But it's stuff, I guess. So, eh. oh, might as well check it while we're standing here. No eggs. Not taking the feathers. All right, tally ho. Stupid. <laughs> Dang it, man. I had my map open, and I, when I hit the button to get out of the map, it didn't get out of it. So we got an infection now. It's a good thing I have some honey. Go ahead and use that. We got a small abrasion. Can I just use a, let's see, a treated abrasion? I can use that. We're good to go on pretty much everything. You're just going to have to chill, dude. Ow! <laughs> Son of a biscuit. What an a-hole. All right. Let's continue on, shall we? This came from, but free loot is always okay to stop and pick up, unless it's garbage. <laughs> Wasn't even worth stopping for. Ooh, another shirt we can scrap down, and some orange dye we don't need right this second. Yay! All right, what's what's going on here? We all are you going after my shopping cart? <laughs> oh no, you did not, lady. There's plenty of shopping carts around here. If you're just trying to get your groceries, I understand, but you stay away. Jiggles, what's going on? Are you, you're not trying to steal from my orchard, are you? <laughs> she looks like she's surprised. Hey, Walt, what's up? All right. So we got a small little party that showed up over here while we were gone. Did you bring anything good to the party? Um, no, not really. Looks like you probably just left somebody else's party and you decided to steal the fine china. Why they weren't looking? It's typical. All right, we're highly encumbered, but it's okay. We're home anyway, other than our small little ouchies we got because of a stupid bird. We should be okay. Let's get in here, turn this stuff in, see if we have anything useful we can sell. I'm assuming we probably do. Like a chainsaw. We got several chainsaws at the house. So we're going to get rid of the one that we have. All right, dude, give me something really good. I mean, really good. You've made my day. Yeah, I did. Okay, no, 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 no. Scrap skill notes. I'm taking those. Those are the most valuable. Nope. Okay, I need to talk to him now. Could you be any louder? <laughs> yeah, I can. You have pretty much the same thing. More skill notes. We're definitely going to take those. I think we have enough to make the mechanic stuff. All right, let's see what kind of stuff we can sell him real quick. Well, that's about all the stuff I have that I actually want to sell him, which wasn't... A whole, wait, day 39. Hang on, he reset today. Let me see if you got anything good on you here. Like your secret stash. Do you have anything that's just like really good? That I just have to have. That would just be great if you had anything that I didn't already have on me. No, nope, he's got nothing on him that I want. Nothing just like super exciting. I mean, again, he's got stuff on him that I could definitely use, but man, it's so disappointing when he resets and it's like, you have the same crap you had when I left, just in a slightly different order. So we got a bunch of stuff to drop off. I think we'll have enough to kind of get the mechanics class going, if that's what I'm going to go with. I'm pretty sure I am, but I do don't want to double check. No. So now the double tapping actually worked. Uh, you know, for a split second, I glanced around the corner and saw all this empty area. My first thought was, where the hell are my chests at? That's up there. They've only been up there for like two weeks now. I'm just trying to make sure nobody else broke in here. Okay, I think we're okay. <laughs> Good God. Okay, let me drop off a few things real quick. All right, I think that's everything. Let's go ahead and take these over here. That's going to take us up to 138. That's how many? We need 120 of those. Okay, so we need paper. We need a quill. I hope we don't need more than one. Okay, I want to double check real quick just to make sure that I know what I'm getting into. I got two points available. So I think the mechanic class is where I was wanting to get to because Master Mechanic allows me to be able to make the oil pump, auto shoddy, motorbike, 4x4, uh, bigger things than I need. Robotics would help out. Uh, salvage operation would help when I'm actually collecting stuff. So I think this is the one that I should probably go into next. I mean, obviously, scientists would be nice to be able to have some of this stuff over here. But, you know, I, I've got Laborer. The Hunter class would be nice for being able to get some stealthy stuff up here. I'm, I'm doing it. I'm going for class mechanic here. So that's just what we're going to have to do. And uh, hopefully it will turn out well for me. 
Let's see, where where is it? It's, uh, let's see, what is it called? Blank class paper? That's this, right? Bundle skill notes, paper, ink, and quill. Okay, so for the ink, I just need eggs, black dye, and honey. All right, so I think I have black dyes right over here. Yep. I don't know why I need eggs and honey for that, but okay, sure, whatever. And should get plenty of honey. Can I just make ink here? Actually, no, I have to make it at the chemistry station. I almost guarantee that. Yep, ink. You know, okay, I'll just make the one. Won't take but three seconds. That's good to go. Uh, three seconds and I had two seconds worth of wood. <laughs> get your mind out of the gutter. You don't, you don't know. <laughs> good God. This, I swear, things just, they always start off really nice and then they just kind of run off, run out of here. Okay. Class, blank class paper we can make. We need one more ink, really? I don't, I knew I was going to need more than that. All right, so I need eggs, black dye. Oh, I didn't, jars of honey. I have. Did I not get, I have an extra black dye, don't it? It's right here. Or did I just not click next on the ink thing here? Oh, yeah, I forgot you can only... Okay, I don't know why, but it only lets it run one at a time. I, for some reason, when I was trying to do that same thing last time, you can't use the arrows to select your quantity. You have to do just one at a time. Don't know much, but I know I don't like that. Blank class paper is going to take it a couple moments to do its thing. So while it's doing its thing, I'll put you right here so I know where you are for next time. Put you up there. You and you over there. And put you back in here, and we'll be good to go. Let's see, ammo-wise, we're okay on all the stuff that we need. We'll, oh, hang on. Every time I auto-sort, it puts, it swaps these out here. It moves the 10 over, and it just gives me... Oh, it's because it moves 8 over and does that. That's why it's not... Yeah, you know, you know. Go ahead and get some food in me real quick. All right, let's wait for this to get done and see how much of this one class we can actually get done in a day. That'd be kind of nice. And there we go. We got that. That's good to go. Go ahead and uh, recipes. Let's see. We're going to do the mechanic. Go ahead and craft you. Get this. Read it. And now we are a mechanic. Sweet. What does it want us to do first? Plant fibers and sharp rocks and a stone axe. Okay. All right. Well, I have some of that stuff already with me here. There's the uh, we're sharp rocks and plant fibers got that i may even have a stone axe already wait that wouldn't be up in here it'd be in my tools there might be a stone axe in here just if there's not it's not like it'll take me more than a half a second to craft one bam first one done gave me some crappy clothes ta-da take apart a car can do it's probably one not too far from here let's just see you know what we're gonna take the old uh jalopy down the road a little bit and see because this one's kind of fun to drive around he says with sarcasm. All right, let's cruise down the road at breakneck speed here and see if we can't find a car to disassemble. And there we go. Here's a nice beater right there we can take apart. Let's see, maybe, I, didn't, I don't think I can search this one. Nope, all right, let's take it apart real quick. Good to go. I'm also realizing right now that most of what it wanted actually to do was just gas and iron. Go ahead and take those nails. I could have just grabbed those out of the chest. Ooh, nice. Decent chunk of oil. You got any good plants over here? Switch back over to this. Get back on. I like it when we are far enough into it now that we can do some of these quests just by pulling stuff out of the chest. Oh my god, this thing turns like a... It doesn't turn. Let's just put it that way. It'd be easier just to pick it up and put it back down. Anyway, let's go back home real quick. Close enough. We're just we're just gonna leave you right there. That's close enough. You crashed going up the driveway. I'm not even convinced you could make it up there again. Thing was jerking around all over the place. All right, iron we have plenty of. Bam, that's done. What did it give us here? A chunk of iron, some first aid kits. Take apart several cars. Gather gas cans. Okay, well I actually don't need to gather. I've got it in here, so I'll save me the trouble of even having to do that. Whoops, wrong button. Or missed the button. Bam, Dunskies. All right, now we need a battery and an engine. This is going to be easy. See what I mean? If I could just grab the stuff that's out of my chest here, that would be great. Okay, let's see. Battery, engine. Done. Got it. Okay, mechanical parts and electrical parts. I have some mechanical parts on me already. Let's see. There's those, and the electrical parts are right there. Done. 
duct tape can do. Man, this is fan freaking tastic. If it didn't cost me any resources to even make the book to start with, and a blunder buy. I'm, I know I have blunder buses. You know what? I think I, when I was cleaning out some of the chests, I think I actually scrapped some of my blunder bus. This is, it looks like I did. They, they would be right up around here if I had them. I scrapped them because I'm like, I'll never need those again. I don't know why I think things, I don't know. But we can make one real quick and then just scrap it back down. Won't take but about eight seconds. It's giving us a bunch of stuff. I mean, we got parts and stuff here. It's kind of nice. A little bit of food, a little bit of water. Give me that and done skis. Quest completed. Yeah, baby. We are a mechanic. We are not a master mechanic. Me mechanic? That's a word. Yeah, that, that's a word. All right, so our salvage all over a little. You know what? I don't. Maybe I should just stop talking. All right, let's see. Robots do more damage. That'd be great. Faster fire rate. Uh, increased range will be good. You can deploy multiple robots, but only the closest will be active. Well, that makes sense here. All right. Grease Monkey, if we do this one, we can crash mini bikes. We already have one. This one will mechanics workbench. Unlocks the gas can recipe, both of which I already have. Let's see, salvage. We're we're okay on this one. So I think we we should probably put a point in here. Because that'll help out with something. Let me see. What's the other thing I need to put some points into? Alright, I should probably put another one into quality Joe here. Our scavenging level is at 69. Nice. Uh, fast Eddie, we're not doing anything there because we are uh, we don't need faster looting speed. Really, we need better quality things. So I'm going to put another point into there. Increases our loot level by 10. Maybe we'll start getting some much better, higher things. Okay, well, we at least finished that class. Let me put some stuff back up in here. I don't need... All right, well, that's not much. I mean, it's stuff. We actually completed it. I'm, I'm honestly kind of curious now if I should have taken the mechanic class. I mean, I need to get master mechanic. What I really need to get is the master scavenger class so I can make the large backpack so it'll open up the rest of my inventory. I don't get as encumbered as I did once before, but enough that I would still like to be able to have the big A backpack. All right, well, let's go over here and see if he's got a job. It's only 2.30 in the afternoon. We should have ample time to be able to get some more stuff done for him. Are you friendly? I am friendly. <laughs> you kind of sounded creepy there, Chief. I'm not sure if I want to be friends with you. All right, let's... We got a little bit of money on him. We don't have near as much money as we used to. All right, what about... Let's see, tool crafting? No, no. I think steel crafting, concrete mixing... Four, wait, 400 for... Sure, I'll put one in there what kind of jobs do you got see fetching clears are good that's two kilometers away clear zombies clear zombies you know both of these aren't too far away a fetching clear does better than most things as far as like experience but that's south and east that's going to be way out in the middle of nowhere i don't want to do a buried supplies we'll do a clear zombies this one's real close gas station oh nice that one should be just right up the road right tall I don't know if we've cleared that one yet or not in the past, so we may or may not be able to double loot it. I don't know. We'll go up there and see real quick. But it shouldn't be much of an issue. It's still only a tier two. We will do some repairs on our base here in the near future. For anybody who's kind of um, kind of stressing over whether we'll get it done, since we do have the horde on every 10 days now, we still have some time. Yes, I definitely need to go through and finish fixing all of this before the next horde starts up. But if everything goes absolutely horrible and somehow or another a horde spawns in on a night it's not supposed to, I can always go over to the old backup right over there. And uh, it should be okay. So, we're going to clear this gas station out. May or may not have enough time to get some more stuff done there. I, uh, I need like a thousand skill points. That would be nice. Just an extra thousand. Okay, I'll, I'll be generous and say an extra hundred would be nice. But... A thousand would be nice too, so I could go ahead and max out everything. And then I don't have to worry about that. Oh, I have had some people tell me like, hey Cap, if you need to get books and schematics and blah blah blah, why don't you find a you know a bookstore? I'm like I've been looking for a bookstore. I've looked in every town I've been to so far, and I haven't found one, man. So if they're around here, I don't know where they are. Oh, I haven't been here. Nice. Gasoline, sweet. Some papier. Nice. I'm not taking the bones. That's just something I'm not dealing with. You got anything in here that I just have to have? I mean, I'm doing okay on food, really, for the most part. Uh, it's a radiated dude taking the siesta. But you know what I am going to do? I'm going to double loot these gas pumps. Aw. 
Oh man, that was I was just I was just knew that was gonna be a good thing. I was gonna be like, bam, double up the get. Oh man, just set off the alarm for one coin. I mean, it's better than a few bones, but no bones about it. Let's see. I hope this doesn't attract anything that could actually hurt me. All right, so it looks like the one radiated dude that was taking a nap over here is not there anymore. Ooh, let's see if we can't get a bolt to the head here. Yeah, I bet there's a dude. Hang on, turn off my headlamp. I bet there's a dude hiding behind this shelf here. If I were to make an educated guess, <laughs> well, so much for my educated guess. I guess I'm happy that I was wrong. Uh, we'll worry about the garage in a little bit. I see a dude taking a a leak or I don't know what he's doing. He's doing something he probably shouldn't be doing out there. Repair kits are nice. More wire tools I don't need. And I'll take the food and leave the bones. So all we have to do is just clear the area. So once we get rid of all the idiots that's in here, we should be able to just head back home. Is there nothing else in this little room here? Can I even get up in the attic? No, it's a tiny... You know what? Hang on. I'll, I'll check real quick. There's probably nothing... Uh, there's probably nothing in this little area up here, but... So at least... Again, I should just stop saying things. Every time I say something so far... It, the game is just like, oh yeah, oh yeah, well, here, how about this? How about we do the complete opposite of everything you just said? Uh, a little bit of yeast, some electrical parts. I had to use the yeast to be able to make some bread, so that's kind of nice to get some back, I guess. Oh, hey, that's... Frank, don't wake up Sid over here. He's trying to take a nap. I'm sure all that standing around is exhausting. Well, that... Big jumps. Did, what did you take a knee out jumping over that trash pile? Whoops! Oh, that was a nice. That was a nice little bob there. Uh, I'll give it to you here. Ready? Hey, careful! This this floor is unstable. Hey, careful! You're gonna hurt your other knee, dude. Oh, hey! What's up, Charlie? How about no, Scott? You better have something good after coming running up at me. A little bit of ammo, Winchester rifle parts, generic rifle parts. Oh, I did have somebody ask, and I'm not 100% certain, but I'm pretty sure I know the answer. That if you scrap like an extra pistol or something, you scrap it down, it gives you the parts. Because, you know, the thing I need to be able to make the next, an upgraded P225 is pistol parts, and I don't have any. I don't think it works that way. I don't think you can scrap um, actual guns and get parts and stuff anymore. I don't. I don't think it does. Uh, okay, so that's just Gary. Nutshot. Yeah, we do that a lot, but you know what? I mean, if you're going to fall down balls first facing me, and that's the one thing I can shoot first, I'm sorry, man, but you're going to get a... You're going to get a, a bullet in the junk. That's just it's how it has to be. That's an okay shovel. I mean, I got to steal one here, so this one's way not nearly as good, but I could at least sell that one. At least it's a good level. Hang on. What's going on over here? Here. Look, can, can I help you out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hut! You're going to get shot in the nuts, too. Hope you're wearing a cup. Didn't look like it. Here, let me help you out. You seem to be struggling. And... A little knife to the face. How about we go to Chetty to the face? Ooh, nice. She pooped out a bag, too. Oh, she's wearing his jersey. They must have been a thing. I'm, I, I'm sorry, man. Prom is ruined for you guys forever. Oh, well. You'll forgive me or you won't. Let's see, this one's destroyed. A little bit of steel on there. I definitely want to take this apart since we're here. I'm guessing there's some people downstairs. I'm guessing there's some people downstairs that I gotta take out still. Splint, those are useless, man. They don't do anything for you. A little further. Just 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 a little further. Okay, I don't have to be up there. Spare parts box. Ooh, what are you? Butchering tool schematic? I swear I just got one of those. I swear I did, because it gave me the ability to 
read a, a, a to make a butcher knife or something like that that I didn't need. All right, well, let's go down here and see if there's anybody else that's down here that we have to kill. Anybody? Nobody down. Wait, hold on. Is this? There's a. Isn't there a room down here? I don't know. Oh, hold on. The other person is up there. I can see it on the old radar thing. Decent claw hammer. Some more calipers. There's two of those. Some more wood frames. I'm okay with. Let's see. Are y'all plugs? You kind of seem to be in an innocuous spot here. No, but that does remind me something I can do, and it's one of those I didn't really even think about it beforehand. On the horde base, I can make a bunch of plates, even though there's just wooden plates and upgrade them a few times, and put those on the outside of the blocks like these are, and it's just one more line of defense that the zombies have to beat down before they can hurt me, basically. So, it would behoove me to do that. Okay, so they're up on the rooftop. All right, let me see if there's a... Okay, you're locked. There's a ladder. Ooh. Oh, it's destroyed. Nice, that's a decent chunk of grain alcohol. We need all that for some Molotovs. Let me get this station broke down. Sweet, sweet. All right, let's see how many people we have up here to take out. All right, any of them birds? Hello? Headlamp off. Let's see if we can't sneak a little bit. I mean, we're in sun. Uh oh, hey, what's up? Oh, it's just Tom. Are you all that's up here, Tom? Back up, dude. Oh, you and Brittany. Nice. No hate. No hate. You do what you gotta do. I'm gonna sit here and just beat on a boob, apparently. Hey. Lois? That ain't Lois. Hey, stop hitting me, ladies. Is that everybody? That's everybody. Alright, did you have anything good up here with you? Having a little bit of a party. Sorry to ruin that for you. At least we didn't get infected or another break or something. A double pocket mod. I've got triples on everything that I can put pocket mods on, so it's not really helping me much. More garbage. I mean, I'll take that. I'm not taking the bones. I'm just I'm not sure why that's the thing. Scrap you down. It's nice that I still have some parts or some uh, book thingies left over after the last thing. I know that makes sense. The thing after the thing. You know what I mean. Okay, so we should be able to make this jump here uh, uh, don't break a leg there we go and we're good to go got the Whataburger over there for anybody who doesn't live in the southern US area uh, Whataburger is like I said it's a, it's pretty much a religion here in Texas ate there not that long ago myself still delicious man one of my favorite things I love about when I was growing up Whataburger be out late with friends you know out driving around somewhere not drinking because I'm responsible but to come rolling up at those Whataburgers that are open 24 hours a day, about 11, 30, 12 o'clock at night, when they start serving breakfast, and get some freshly cooked hot sausage egg or bacon egg or potato egg and cheese taquitos. Oh, man. Can't even... Um, shoot, I kind of want one right now. I wonder if... <laughs> let's see, what time is it? Are they open? I don't need one, but dang it, I want one now. I'm jonesing for a breakfast burrito all of a sudden. May have to see if I can sneak over there tomorrow. All right, let's see if he gave me anything good. I'm going to guess not because he has it. Uh, nope, 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 nope. Tempered blade mod is the only thing that's worth having and mostly just worth selling. The rest of this crap I don't need. All right, I'll take that. You got anything else that's worthy of my time? There's a fetch and clear, another clear. This one's southeast. I mean, I guess I can take this one and do that next time. It's an old pyramid house. Let's see where this direction is going to be, if it's an area I've even been to yet. You know, I think there's a that other trader's right over here, like right here-ish. If I recall right, I think we stopped here last time. So we may go do this one tomorrow and then see if this trader has anything good. Hang on, I think I could probably sell a couple things to him. I hear some zombies walking around outside. And let's see, I'll hang on to you just in case. But this one I'm definitely going to sell because I've got triples and everything else. And I'll sell this stupid jersey. It's only 11 cents, but I'm going to get rid well, of it anyway. About time you bought something. I didn't really buy anything. You bought for me, if you recall. Okay, kind of sounds like we might have a wandering horde out here. Let's go see real quick. Hello? I thought I saw somebody running over in the distance. See the construction worker here, but I thought I saw somebody running right over there. 
I, I don't remember when it was. I think it was a couple of videos ago, but I think somebody said... Yeah, so they're running somewhere. Somebody said they saw the wandering trader show back up on the map. Uh, he hasn't been here since... He uh, hasn't been here in a while. Are y'all shooting at the zombies way over there? I mean, you do your thing. I guess you got infinite ammo and sort of an aimbot. So if that's what you want to do, you go for it. I'm going to go back home, though. But, uh, huh, let me, let me double check here. Because I haven't... It's one of those that he disappeared for a long time and I just forgot. And I haven't seen him on anything in a while. I'm looking for just a dot in here. So if he's here, he's not anywhere nearby. He's definitely a great resource for supplies and such. But that's really about it. I do want to check because I think in the last video or video before I checked. And I may or may not have destroyed a tree because I thought it might be ready and it wasn't. Let's see. Are you... Are you? Dang, that tree is way tall now. Okay. All right. So both of these are still growing. They're not ready to go. The apple trees are not ready to go either. These are... Okay, so that's still not there. These are ready to go. So I need to refill these. What I need to do is I need to make another one right there. Um, and get rid of this one. Uh, get one of the, get rid of the one that's on the end because it seems to be broken. Really? Nothing besides feathers on any of those. That's just kind of stupid. All right, let me get rid of this one. It seems to be busted. I don't know why. I'll make another coop and put it over there. Let me make some more seed. Hey, give me that. Okay, so let me see. I need some apples. I can make some seed real quick. Animal seed. We'll do one, two, three, four, five. Let me see. The animal coop. Or chicken coop, whatever. Uh, wood, fiber, and animal... F Wait, did that say animal seeds? Actually, I'm going to need animal feed. Actually, I need two more of those. That won't take me just a second. Boom. Let's see, plant fibers are right here. Should be able to make the coop pretty easily yep this won't take but just 30 seconds by the time we actually get back out over here we should be okay let me get you down here dang it i'm gonna need one more to be able to get that one ready anyway animal feet uh animal seat boom oh no i didn't i just forgot to grab the other one now i have six. Oh well i'll need it eventually anyway all right let's get all these over here replanted like this all right, so give me my chicken coop. I'll just swap you out real quick. I'm going to put you right here. And I'm going to put it, seeds in you. Why can't I put seeds? Hang on, hang on, hang on. This, that might be what it is here. Where's, I was about to say, where's my axe here? Okay, so that might be a... Because it registers above the block and stuff there, it may not... No, no, it's not that. There's... Something's on this end piece here. I don't know what it is, but it's stopping it from being able to put anything here. I thought maybe something above here, but it's the same kind of wall it is above all the rest of those. I don't know. See, are you done? You're not done yet. You're All of you are done. I guess I could technically work on you a little bit more. These things over here, I know I could technically plant some water. I could get some water up underneath and plant in those, but it might be easier just to dig them up because I'm pretty sure, at least, let's see here. No, okay, so digging them up, you don't get the stuff back for making them. Like vanilla, if you have a player made planter box like this and you dig it up with a shovel, you get it back. Apparently, in Darkness Falls, you don't even get dirt back. It's just like, screw you, hippie. You get nada. I don't know why this one's not working. Any suggestions on that one? I'm mostly ears. Just let me know. All right. I think we've done as much as we're going to in this episode. I need to do some organization of crap again. That's pretty much what I mostly do over here is just organize crap. So anyway, but we're going to go ahead and wrap this one up here. I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, do me a favor and leave a like on it. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe if you're not already so you don't miss out on future videos. And in the meantime, you guys have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you later.